two years, the museum deems it uh, a worthy recipient of a, uh, an award for journalism and for excellence and just outstanding work, in the, particularly in the field of winter sports journalism. This award has never gone to a snowboarder, let alone a snowboard journalist. Well, that's all about to change here tonight. When you say the phrase excellence in snowboard journalism, there's really only one name that comes to mind. And, we just, and it just so happens that this person is from Vermont. Now, Patrick Bridges, it would be appropriate to say right now that this is a man who's forgotten more about snowboarding's past, present, and future than any of us will ever know. But the thing is, he hasn't forgotten anything. So at this time, I'd like to welcome Patrick to come up here. Yeah, 